Good morning, Tom. Yes, Labour has won the Wakefield by-elections with a majority of 4,925 votes, taking the traditional red wall seat back from the Conservatives. They gained this seat in 2019, and before that, Labour had been in power here for more than 80 years. There was a turnout of 39.1% in Wakefield. The Conservatives came in second place, followed by Independent Akif Akbar in third and the Yorkshire Party in fourth. There were 15 candidates vying for the seat here and in contrast to Honiton and Tiverton, the Lib Dems actually came in sixth place here in Wakefield. Speaking after the result, we're here now at Labour headquarters in Wakefield where there are banners out, vote Labour, vote Simon Lightwood. And speaking after the result, he said, and he addressed the Prime Minister and said, Boris Johnson, your contempt for this country is no longer tolerated. Your government has no ideas, no plan to address the big issues facing our country. And after the result was announced, he also said that Wakefield had started the next Labour government, saying we've definitely passed the test. We have demonstrated that Labour is ready to rebuild the Red Wall. We saw previous Labour voters who didn't vote for us last time come back and some Conservative voters flip too. And speaking to people here on the streets of Wakefield, they said their main concern now is the cost of living and they'd like to see more investment here in the city, get rid of the empty shops and put more into the high street. That's what they want to see now from Simon Lightwood.